And then, Mr. Crittenbing, on, on Tuesday uh, at the House Foreign Affairs Committee, you acknowledged that the administration has not sanctioned a single official under the Uyghur Human Rights Policy Act. Have you ever advised uh, Secretary Blinken, uh, Deputy Secretary Sherman, or any other senior U.S. government official to delay sanctioning PRC officials under the Uyghur Human Rights Policy Act? Mr. Chairman, two, two responses. One, We've taken a, a range of actions, not under the Uyghur Human Rights uh, Protection Act, but a range of other actions, including under Global Magnitsky and a range of entity listings, uh, and also visas restrictions to punish and hold accountable uh, Chinese officials. I, I'm not in a position to comment in detail on uh, matters that are pre-decisional and under deliberation. But well, Have you ever advised any senior U.S. government official to delay sanctions under that act? I'm not in a position to comment on pre-decisional matters that are under deliberation. What I can assure you I'm is talking about sort of – this isn't pre-decisional. I'm, I'm talking about past actions that you've done. Have you ever advised – For matters that are under deliberation, I, I'm not going to comment in detail on any discussions that may or may not have happened. But what you I, don't want to – you don't want to answer you, the question – I will commit to you what I committed to our uh, – to uh, Chairman McCall and, and other uh, HVAC committee members. We are committed to enforcing U.S. law. We have done so and we will do so, including – uh, under this act and including against uh, a range of Xinjiang officials consistent with what we've done to date. I guess I'll so ask one more time. So you, you, have you ever advised any senior U.S. government official to delay sanctions under the Uyghur uh, Human Rights and Policy Act? What I have advised is that we will carry out uh, our obligations uh, under the law, but I'm not going to comment on the details of our internal deliberations. Okay. Uh